Bombs, profit, pro dig and make a paper till the sun goes down. Do you dig me? Yo, off top, man, listen, this Friday, we got the high res interview dropping. And I've kept this one on the hushity hush, 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 hush tone. You feel me? I've had it probably now for like a month, bro. Big shout out to High Res, man, for coming through. Mad, to, my bad, I had to check the camera. Um, Big, big shout out to High Res for coming through, bro. I appreciate it, bro. It was a super dope turnout. Um, Off top, I'm going to just tell y'all the audio quality. It, the audio quality is A1, but the video quality is not the best just because the Wi-Fi wasn't crazy. So, whatever. Be on the lookout for that. But, anyways, yo, bro, what I'm trying to tell you is, man, these interviews are dope. And I'm excited. I'm glad that I started doing it, bro, because I've learned... First of all, I've learned a lot. Second of all, I've grown from it. And third of all, grown meaning like as a person. Like I learn a lot of a lot of new things about these artists, which is super dope. And and it also teaches a lot of people in the entertainment industry kind of what to look out for, what to move, um, stuff like that. So I feel like it's something that's really dope that a lot of people, you know, pay attention to and see learn different stuff from being in this industry and stuff like that and um you know kind of get to know these artists better which is super dope and um i'm glad that i get to do that bro and also on friday i'm gonna be shooting out to boston bean town you know what i mean to um check out the homie high res at um what's it called uh the middle east i've been out there a bunch of times screw performed out there and stuff like that but i'm gonna definitely be out there checking that out y'all already know y'all know how i get down with the get down bro i keep the camera on me so y'all already know i'm gonna be shooting something i'm gonna be shooting something probably a little day to day um you know I, i'm gonna probably do something for you know i try to do something for him as well if he wants something you, you know just the behind the scenes stuff sometimes people aren't able to get that i don't know his travel situations or who he's moving with and all that kind of stuff so i can't speak for that but all i'm saying is i'm there and if the homie needs a camera bro we good we lit you know what i mean i got an arm got two of them on me you feel me we gonna get it how we live you know um so off top that's dope but i ain't gonna hold you man this is probably one of my favorite interviews i mean i think every single time i say that it's not like i have a ton but like this one i feel like it explains a big side of high res that i don't know if a lot of people know because i wasn't super f familiar with it like until i spoke to him so it's like now i got a better understanding of you know his grind his person so Yo, it's dope. It's 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 definitely lit. I ain't gonna hold you. So you know, I'm gonna chop it up with with, with high res too when he touches down. You know, um, again, big shout out to him. I appreciate him on the ticket. You know, he told me to come through, boss. He said, bring everybody. You know, I'm like, listen, I'm gonna bring everybody who I know who down. You know what I mean? Like when I say people, like I don't I don't be around a ton of people, but like my people, you know. So my people, we we gonna be there. You know. We going to be there, bro. Um, it's going to be dope, though. Uh, I'm, I'm mad excited. I believe this is the first uh, to stop on his tour, too. He told me that he was out. I'll just give y'all a little bit of a little bit. But he told me he was going to do um, it like that. He said that he would be going to probably like five, six cities at a time, you know. So he'll go this place, this place, this place, this place, and then take a few months off recuperate figure out what he got to do to bust the next you know five cities do the same thing over and over again which is what you got to do man to reach them people and this independent grind's real bro like if you want to make a living for yourself this what you got to do is dedicate it takes time bro it takes time that shit does not happen overnight and that's what um that's why i res was talking about on this interview he was just saying like yo bro like I didn't start from nothing. This shit all came from somewhere. You know, I've been grinding, putting in work. So I'm like, respect. He, yo, he breaks down some real stuff. He told me some stuff. I was like, damn, that's fly. I ain't going to hold you. He got some, yo, some surprise. Y'all going to see. Just tune in. Just tune in. And also, I'm going to announce this too because a lot of people already know. But I do got a Moxis interview dropping as well. Mad excited for that. I F's with Moxis, hard body. I've been listening to his stuff a lot lately. And, yo, I bump it word up i bump it i'm not gonna hold you so i'm excited for that one i did you know a little research and stuff like that while i was doing my research like i do just because you know you gotta familiar yourself familiarize with yourself with every person i feel like 
And that's kind of what I do. And, you know, I like to talk to them and, and kind of get a feel, you know, a little bit before nothing crazy. But before every time before I start recording, I just, you know, chop it up a little bit with them. I say, hey, listen, you know, I'm not recording off top. Is there anything you want to say? Yada, yada. Anything, you know, off limits, nothing like that. I just, you know, make sure just out of respect for them. And um, yeah, so that's what it is. So that's how I handle every situation. So I kind of get a good feeling of them. And you know, most of the time, it always ends up turning out to just end up being a, a normal conversation that we end up have just just on some regular, regular stuff, which is kind of just how I like it because then it allows room for for those people to come back and tell other stuff later. You know what I mean? It's not like we covering everything at one time and you can't do nothing no more and then blah blah blah. Nah, bro trying to you know make this a thing you feel me make sure that every single time a person got something they can promote what they want you feel me and come to my platform and say hey listen you know i got this drop and this drop and yada 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 you already know what it is man but hi res bro again i appreciate the love dog this shit gonna be epic I'm going to send it to him. I already got it. It's been up for a long time because I wanted to make sure it wasn't going to get demonetized because for some reason, YouTube just does that. So it's been up for a minute. It's ready. It's ready. That's not even a question. It's definitely ready. Um, but yeah, y'all get it first. You know, you know, I'm going to just drop the little bomb on him. Um, it's Tuesday. So, you know, I wanted to promote it a little bit before Friday. I always drop videos fairly early. So. Um, it should be, except for sometimes, don't even trip though, don't even trip, cause this one's not early, but shut up, so, yeah man, so, <laughs> bruh, Friday, Boston, if you around the air, I talked to, I talked to a couple people, I talked to a couple of people, shout out to the homie, you know who I'm talking about, um, I'm going I'm to holler at Joey Notto, too, because Joey Notto lives a little bit, ways away, but if he around, bruh, I'm going to tell him to come through, because, yo, if the YouTubers around, bro, we gonna get it lit. You know what I mean? We gonna, you know, we gonna go do the little camera stuff. You know what I'm saying? That's what we do. So be on the lookout for that, yo, Joey Nato. If you watching this, bro, come out to the Boston show because you know, power to the people. You feel me? We gonna kick it, bro. You feel me? We gonna, we gonna do the little thing, thing. You know, it's gonna be lit. But um, yeah, bro, high res Friday. The interview will be dropping. I'll be at the show Friday, which is, you know, I feel like a good little thing. And then, you know, I'll drop something after that. All kinds. Of, we going to get it. You know, we it's profit, man. Be on the lookout. Let me know in the comment section if there's any videos you want me to do, too, because I'm going to do some lists. But let me know what list, though. Let me know what list. I got the Hook is Trash list coming. I'll be having to work on shit like that because I got to make sure it's the best ones. Then... I got a few other ones, but let me know in the comment section what you want, man. It's profit, pro deck, and make a paper till the sun goes down always to infinity and beyond. Grr, bow. All that stuff. Right after I get off the phone, though, I'll, uh, I'm going to get you a ticket to my Boston show. And if you got any friends or family or anybody, you know, just, you know, get them to pull up. That'd be dope. Definitely, man. I appreciate it, bro. I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a pop up. That's for sure. I, yo, shit. Nah, I'm going to see. You said August 2nd? Uh, yeah, August 2nd. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to talk to Screw too. I'm gonna see what's up. I'm gonna yeah. see if you try well, to pop up uh, too. A, every show I have is Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. So. Oh yeah, that's lit. Yeah, the, have you performed at the Middle East before? Um, it's been so long. I don't even remember last time I performed there. But I'm grateful Man. to to be back in a lot of these venues because once again, not that I ever did anything, but you know, I, I'm not like shitting on the walls and pissing. You know, like, yeah, no, I know what you're saying. I, yeah, I, I had I had some bad people around me a while ago. People that were just comfortable taking their percentage and. You know, letting me, letting me, you know, take the shit on the head. You know what I mean? No so it's doubt. Like, whatever the saying is, but it's like I, I'm grateful. I'm grateful to be back in some of these major venues and some of these major cities and just rebuilding and like totally, totally, uh, you know, new chapter of square one. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's a fact, yo. That's big, brother. Middle East is a huge, huge venue in Boston, so that's like that's yeah, where I, everybody I, goes. I'm, I'm, I eat at the uh, I eat at the Middle Eastern spot next to it. It's always yep. like, the little, uh, little restaurant connected to it. So. That's a fact. Yeah, man, we probably have to link or something when you out here, cause like I said, it's right down the way. So I'm around, Absolutely. man. I'll be out here. I uh, text me your information, like your your full name, your legal name, and all that, and, I, and I'll uh, and your email, and I'll send you a ticket. I bet you, man. Hey, I appreciate it, bro. Hey, thank you for coming up here, man. Definitely, anytime. It's all up. Do you do you like just post? I mean, I don't mind you posting little shit. I didn't say anything, or do you chop it up? Uh, it depends on how long it is. Normally, I just put it in two. 
Yeah. Okay. Word. I'm with you, that, bro. I mean, I didn't say anything too wild. So just, just uh, hit me, hit me with, uh, hit me with the link before it comes out. Yeah, definitely, bro. You already know, man, for sure, bro. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. All right, man. Yeah, All right, man. Be good, bro. Be safe. Thank. You.